In this video, you will learn how to calculate the load in each lifting point of the cargo, and also the tension on the sling, based on the given weight and dimension of the cargo. In this example, the weight of the cargo we need to lift is 30 ton. We need to find what is the load in each lifting point and tension on the sling. So we can decide what is the required capacity of lifting gear to be used. This is the other detail and dimension we need for our calculation. If you like this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. This is the top view section of the cargo. As per given dimension, I consider the distance of lifting point is not equal to the center of gravity of the cargo. So we can see the load difference in each lifting point. This is the formula we will use to calculate the load in each lifting point of the cargo. Based on the given formula, start to substituting all given data and start to calculate. You can pause the video and follow the calculation. This is the formula we will use to calculate the tension on the sling after getting the load in each lifting point. Based on the given formula, Start to calculate the tension on the sling. Since the spreader bar and lifting point of the cargo is equal, the angle of the sling below the spreader bar is 90 degree. You can pause the video and follow the calculation. Now we can start to calculate the load above the spreader bar. First we need to find the height of the sling base on the given sling length and lifting point distance to COG. We will use Pythagorean theorem. Calculate the height of sling at number 5. Wire sling length is 6 meter and distance to COG is 4 meter. Calculate the height of sling at number 6. Wire sling length is 6.5 meter and distance to COG is 4.5 meter. Next, start to calculate the total load in each sling. By adding the weight of the spreader bar and also the lifting gear weight, I assume the weight of lifting gear is 0.2 ton. Once you get the total weight for each side, 
and the height of the sling. Start to calculate the wire sling tension. See the below formula and calculation. You can pause the video and follow the calculation. Summary As per our rigging calculation, we get all the tension in each sling. Now you can decide the size of lifting gear to be used above the sling tension. Make sure you have enough safety factor for your sling base in the sling tension.